What's up guys? In this video I wanted to talk to you about broad match modifier types, which is a special type of match type that is not directly available when you go through the um, the keyword match type. So as you can see here, there's only three that you can use that we've discussed in the last video. Broad match modifier is something that is also really useful. So I wanted to tell you what it is and how you can set it up and how it can benefit you. So what a broad match modifier type is, is it basically means that the words that you put in must be present in order for your ad to show up. So if your words that you list as broad match modifier are not there, the ad will not show up. Kind of like a phrase match type. But the differences between a phrase and broad match modifier is that broad match modifier can have any words in any order and they can have any words in between. So for example, my broad match modifier terms are by flying monkeys. If I were to use that as a phrase, people who say by super flying monkeys would not see my ad. However, with broad match modifier, as long as those three words are somewhere in the search term, my ad will trigger. So if I say buy, super good, monkeys, great, this is awesome, flying now, if they type that in, my ad will show, okay? So basically, it's kind of the best of both worlds between the phrase and the broad because with the phrase, the words must be present. Um, and with the broad match, it's kind of extending the list and and considering other possibilities, which is what we're doing in broad match modifier. So the way we put that in is we use a little plus sign just before the word that we're inputting. So for example, here's our diabetes, which was actually approved. Uh, this head was uh, surprisingly approved. As you saw, our landing page is not meant for, for selling. So I had to pause it. But if, if, if we need to put broad match modifier, what we're going to do is put a little plus sign just before plus sign right there, right? So after we save it, now that we put a plus sign, what this means is that those two words must be present in order for our ad to show. If they're not present, the ad will not show. And they can be in any order. They can be mellitus diabetes, right? And the ad is still going to show. Or they can say, uh, this is awesome, diabetes, mellitus, how to do this, mellitus, whatever, the ad will still show, okay? So that's kind of the difference. Um, and you don't have to use two pluses, actually. You can, for example, use one plus here. Now what that's going to do is that means the word diabetes must be there exactly as is, but mellitus does not have to be there per se. You, it can be a synonym, just like under broad match types. So uh, and any synonym of, of mellitus will, will show up, which is actually why we're not putting a plus there. It goes straight into broad match, regular broad match, not the modifier. And don't be concerned, by the way, that it says broad match here. Uh, because we put a plus sign, it is broad match modifier. So don't worry that, oh my God, it's, it's, it's a broad match. It's going to show way too many options, right? So, so that's that. And why you may want to use this? Because phrase match may be too limited and broad match may be way too broad you don't want things that are synonymous with your keywords you want your keywords so broad match modifier allows you to kind of have something in between so have a bit more impressions and possibly quality clicks than phrase but not as many impressions and low quality clicks as broad all right so that's about it i hope this helped clear it up if you guys have any questions comments or concerns please leave them down below if you enjoyed the video please leave it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you have not for those of you that have subscribed thank you i do appreciate it and i will see you guys in the next video